All right, hey guys, I wanted to do a video kind of playing around in my garage because I got a new outdoor movie set up. So I was just playing around with it to get it ready. Um, I got this new PA system, Rockville. You can see my review on it too. This is phenomenal. Uh, and watch that review, um, great speakers. But I wanted to show you, I have a new projector I got. It is the Vankio Leisure 510. Now it has built in speakers and I've used this inside a few times and it actually sounds pretty good. The speakers built in are like surprisingly good. They would never be loud enough outside here. In fact, I have, uh, my kids brought this out for me to use, Spider-Man. So what we'll do is check this out. Here is the volume and it has a remote here. So I'll turn it up and you can see the volume hopefully on the screen going up. So you'll be able to hear how good this sounds actually. So not horribly sounding. I have the lights on in here, so that's why it looks a little dim. But I'm gonna show you how to, let me turn this down a little bit. <clears throat> I'm gonna show you how to hook this into external speakers. So there's a couple different ways. Um, this is just a regular DVD player. I am gonna, I do have a Blu-ray that I plug into here because this is a high definition, uh, <clears throat> let me turn that down a little more. High definition project projector. So it does have, you know, the HDMI outputs. Right now it comes with this where you just plug your um, AV settings in, uh, plugs in, and um, you can run it right from a regular DVD. So this is just an old DVD player I had because I was playing around. So there's two ways you can do it. If you are using just a regular AV, you can just plug the yellow one in, and then you would take your cords here and you would have to get an extension to run the red and white one over to your speakers or your amp. These have these speakers have a built-in amp in them, so the you know use whatever you have, but these have a built-in amp. But I'll show you an easier way to do it, and you can buy this cord. This cost me eight dollars. It's a 25-foot cord, and on this end it has the two AV outputs, red and white, and then this it just has a 3.5 headphone jack. And as if you can see there there is a headphone jack. So I'll show you how to do that real quick. All you gotta do is, let me get my cord here, and we'll plug it right in there. And then it, oh, let me, I need two hands, hold on a second. Okay, you plug it in there, and that shuts off the sound like you have headphones. So then you're just gonna take this end down here, and you're gonna run this to an amp or wherever you have it, in this case. Uh, these have the built-in amps, so uh, my cord's caught. Hold on a second, let me get untangled. All right, so I'm gonna take my ends here, and then if in the back there you can see I have uh, some plug-ins. I'm gonna plug in the white and the red. And I'm gonna turn this on. You can already hear it on here coming out. And this is your volumes if you want. Adjust the volumes. And I like this too because it has the bass and treble right on it. So we'll turn it around.
So that's what it sounds like. Um, and uh, like I said, just a headphone jack. Whoop, let me get that headphone jack. And if you're doing outdoor movies or something, you're gonna want a 25, 30 foot cord. It was $8 on Amazon. It plugs right back into your, you're gonna need a receiver. This has built-in receivers, but um, very, <laughs> I was very impressed with it. I just actually, the first time I tried it was tonight. So uh, I was, you know, had my fingers crossed it would work good. Um, so if you're looking for some external speakers for your Vankio uh, projector, uh, easy, easy fix right there. So hope that helped you. Take care.